Welcome back, fast food fanatics. Today, we're at Dunkin' Donuts and we're trying a few of their seasonal holiday menu items. Let's crush some calories. So up first, we have their sourdough breakfast sandwich, which looks amazing. It's supposed to be sourdough bread, cherry wood apple smoked bacon, double egg, and then aged white Wisconsin cheddar. And that sounds amazing. It looks amazing. Hopefully it tastes amazing. Let's try it. So definitely getting a real chewy sourdough right off the bat getting a little bit of the um the double egg which is nice it adds a a nice consistency as far as the protein is concerned the bacon itself is pretty crispy not overly perceiving the whole cherry wood smoke thing i think that that's kind of more of just an advertising thing there's a good sourdough flavor there's a good kind of chew and, and and bite on it there's a nice kind of crust on the outside this is a pretty good um representation of a sourdough bacon egg and cheese from Dunkin Donuts. You guys should try this. Next up we have the chai latte with oat milk and this is supposed to be another one of their kind of seasonal signature holiday drinks. It's supposed to have cinnamon, cardamom, nutmeg, the chai latte itself and then uh, oat milk obviously. Let's see how it tastes. That's really good. You definitely get the spices that they're talking about. Anybody who's familiar with chai, you're, you know, a lot of those spices are already kind of in the, the, the chai tea itself. And it's punched up by, you know, whatever else that they added to it. And you're getting a real rich, velvety creaminess from the oat milk. I'm not actually the biggest fan of oat milk, but whatever blend of oat milk that they're using for Dunkin' Donuts is pretty nice. And uh, I think that if you're a fan of oat milk, which seems a lot of people are, or something like a chai latte normally, then this will definitely be a, a favorite of yours. Cheers. We have the Signature Peppermint Mocha Latte. I'm looking forward to this one because I'm a big fan of peppermint and chocolate, and uh, you know, tis the season. So let's see how this one tastes. This is really nice. I think if you're a fan of peppermint and mocha, I definitely am, that this will definitely speak to you. They have a nice blend of the mocha and how it kind of balances out with the coffee. My only complaint about this would be like a lot of Dunkin' Donuts things, I just kind of wish they would have leaned a little bit more into whatever the flavor profile is, which in this case, I feel like it's just lacking a little bit more peppermint for me. Again, your guys' mileage may vary, but still a really tasty drink. Finally, we have the Signature Gingerbread Latte. I was looking forward to this one, mainly because I'm just a big fan of gingerbread. Let's see how it tastes. This one's not bad. Honestly, like a lot of Dunkin' Donut products, again, I just really wish that they would lean into whatever it is the flavor profile is that's supposed to be for the beverage. So in this case, you're getting a little bit of the ginger. There's supposed to be cinnamon in here as well on top. You're getting a touch of that as well. There's supposed to be caramel. I'm not overly picking up on any caramel notes. And then the coffee itself is actually pretty good for Dunkin'. It's not overly bitter. It's pretty smooth. I think out of the three, you guys could probably pass on this one. Final review for you guys. The sourdough bacon, egg, and cheese breakfast sandwich that they had was really tasty. I think most people are going to enjoy that. It was surprisingly good from Dunkin'. I'm not trying to say that to be a jerk, but it was. It, it exceeded my expectation. I thought it was... As good, if not better, than something you would get at maybe some some place like a Starbucks, to be honest, or maybe even like a Panera. The drinks were all pretty good. I would say my personal favorite was the mocha peppermint, and the reason why is just I'm a big fan of mocha peppermint. Your guys' mileage may vary depending on you know what flavor profiles you're interested in. The chai oat milk latte was very good. I honestly think that anybody who enjoys those beverages would enjoy that year round i think that they should maybe try to see if they can keep that one on the menu outside of just the holiday season and my least favorite disappointingly so was the gingerbread latte not that it wasn't good but i just feel like when you have something like the chai oat milk latte that was punched up with the cinnamon and the ginger and the cardamom and it was a little bit more spice forward the gingerbread just kind of fell flat where it was like a lot of the pumpkin spice products that get put out it was sweet but not overly spicy 
not a bad drink. Uh, you guys might still want to try it if you're into the holiday spirit of things already and you just kind of want to start getting into it. You know, the Thanksgiving, Christmas season, Hanukkah, you know, whatever it is that you want to get into. I think Dunkin' Donuts is a place that you guys can absolutely find something that piques your interest. Thanks again for watching, guys. We always appreciate it. Remember, like and share this video. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, turn on those notifications, and I'll catch you on the next one.